So things are a little bit out of rhythm because normally I get my long runs in Saturday morning, but I had other plans. So instead, um, it's about 4 p.m. I'm at the beach and I'm gonna get in my row now. You know, it could have been really easy for me to just skip this one run and, and take it easy, but I, I, I can't, I can't miss anymore. Um, I, if I did then, I would have only disappointed myself. I would have failed myself and I just, I just can't anymore. I'm too hungry. It's <laughs> right now. I feel like a really hungry animal for life who just wants more and more, but who doesn't know exactly what to eat to fuel him um, in, in terms of nutrition, if that makes sense. But all I know is that I'm hungry, I'm gonna eat and I'm gonna try to eat the best things for me. And if I feel better, if things are looking good, if I'm happier, if my outlook on life is getting better, then I know things are, that I'm eating the right stuff. But the thing is, you really don't generally see the effects of eating after one meal. You have to eat the, the same things consistently. I'm not sure if that makes sense at all, but that's what's in my mind. We're going to go ahead and get this 11 miles in. Do I want to run? No, but we're going to do it. We're going to do it because I'm not going to miss. <laughs> not anymore. And just like that, we are done. 11 miles, pace 8.58. And let me tell you, that was not easy at all. My legs felt heavy. They felt real heavy after like mile six. The wind was against me, but we did it. We're done. And guess what? It's in the past now. I was struggling during the actual run, but it's really in the past now. <laughs> It's like, I feel great because guess what? I did something difficult that I didn't want to do and I ended up doing it. And that's what life is. If I continue to do it, I'm just gonna get better at it and I'll feel great. But guess what? Most people don't do that and I have not living my, and I have not been living my life that way. But not anymore. Uh, oh, excuse me. 